Hi friends, welcome back to Dibs on Half with me, Gabby. And as you can tell by the title, your girl is pregnant. So, you're probably like, yeah, that's probably why you felt like crap two videos past talking about this cheese is messing you up. It was pregnancy. Probably the cheese too, but also pregnancy. So, how me and Jesse found out I was pregnant, we've been trying and I took a pregnancy test a couple weeks ago, not knowing that you need this like HCG hormone to be released when something happens inside of you, but it takes a really long time. So you can't really tell if you're pregnant until like literally right before you're about to get your period. So I took it way too early. Didn't think anything about it. Didn't think I was pregnant. We actually decided that maybe we should wait a little bit longer to get pregnant, but the universe had other plans for us. Thank you universe, because the universe always knows what's best, I swear to God. Like, the universe knows what's up. But I woke up in the morning and my friend texted me because she knew I was trying. She's like, "Did you? are you pregnant yet? What's happening? And I was like, I don't know. I'm two days late on my period, but I doubt it. Like, I'm never pregnant. Like, I'm never pregnant. So I doubt I'm going to be pregnant. So I go to Walgreens and get a pregnancy test. The person who rang me up was pregnant, like super pregnant. And I was like, this is a sign from the universe, man. This is a sign from the universe. Go home, pee on the stick. Look at it. Instantly, the line shows up. It was like a plus and a line. Some I have like the two lines, but mine was supposed to have a plus sign in a circle and then an extra line over here. So I saw the two lines right away and I was like, okay, I'm not pregnant, not shot. Leave the bathroom. Come back, like literally five seconds later, look at the pregnancy, pregnancy test. And I'm just like, how? Like, no, there's no way. I'm seeing this wrong, this can't be right. Like, there's no way I am pregnant. Like, it's just so weird. Called my husband, told him I was pregnant. Called my friend who had texted me earlier and she's like, come over. I'm like, girl, look at this. Like, is this real? She's like, yes, you're pregnant. Came home like five hours later, took another pregnancy test. It was even stronger looking than the first one. So I'm like pregnant and they say don't announce it until after a while in case you have a miscarriage. But I'm not like that. If I wanna say something, I'm gonna say it and I don't care what people think I should do or shouldn't do or anything about what other people's opinions are. So I'm gonna announce it and if I happen to have a miscarriage, I'll talk about it because I think to myself like if I have a miscarriage and I didn't know anybody else who had a miscarriage I would feel like this isn't normal it's only me like I would feel so alone so the more people talk about miscarriage because they happen all the time the less people are gonna feel like horrible like yeah it's still a horrible experience I can't even imagine it happening please Jesus but I don't even want to speak it into existence but I feel like it's something that more people should talk about. But anyways, on to a brighter subject. I just made this video because I wanted to come on here and make an announcement before I start cooking. I tried to make a cooking video this morning and what I made was bomb. I might make it for my next video. I'm not even gonna tell you what it is, it'll be a surprise. So hit that subscribe button so you don't miss it. But I thought it was very strange to like announce my pregnancy and then in the same video make some food it seemed weird so i wanted to make a whole separate video so here's my separate video i'm pregnant and i haven't really been having any cravings this morning i was hardcore craving orange juice like orange juice i had to have orange juice um, I also think that I am going to become way more healthy while I'm pregnant because the smell of ground beef alone made me almost like want to throw up. Like I think I'm going to stay away from pork and I think I'm going to stay away from beef, lamb as much as possible 
and I'm still gonna eat chicken, fish, but I have been staying away from meat a lot more. I've been eating eggs and stuff, and I've been eating a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of beans. So look, look forward to some bean recipes in your future. So yeah, I just wanted to come on here and talk to you guys about my pregnancy and thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, let me know and I'll answer them. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video where I'll actually be cooking. Bye.